I'm Bill Monroe. Former Prescott City Councilman John Hanna died following a battle with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. The 59-year-old Hanna was elected to council in September 2009, and he served until March 2012 when he resigned to run for the Yavapai County Board of Supervisors. He lost that race to Supervisor Roly Simmons by 149 votes. Fran Schumacher, who had served three terms on the Presque Valley Town Council from 1999 to 2011, passed away at St. Joseph's Hospital in Phoenix. The 70-year-old Schumacher had also been involved with the 1994 Town General Plan, the Logo Committee, and the Planning and Zoning Commission from 1995 to 1999. 23-year-old Juliana Hirsch and her 9-year-old sister Jess were killed in a head-on collision on Outer Loop Road in Chino Valley. The other driver, 63-year-old Elaine Anderson and 13-year-old Jeremiah Hirsch and his 15-year-old brother Joseph were taken to various hospitals. Jeremiah later died in Phoenix. Anderson and Joseph are expected to survive. Governor Jan Brewer was at the Presque Resort where she spoke at the Arizona Federation of Republican Women Convention. She discussed Arizona's comeback from a deficit less than four years ago to a balanced budget. The Presque City Council approved an up to 4.5% increase in pay for employees in the public safety personnel retirement system. Those who are in the Arizona State Retirement System will get an up to 3% raise and an up to 2% merit raise. The adjustments are in effect as of October 27th and will show up starting with the November 15th paychecks. 64-year-old Bill Holden hit the road on his bicycle as part of a fundraiser for the Yarnell Hill Fire Recovery effort. Holden plans on riding his bike 40 miles a day until he reaches his destination in Springerville where he used to coach. Holden plans on watching the Round Valley Elks play El Chase High School on November 1st. The Yarnell Fire District Board selected Ben Palm as the new fire chief. Palm has been with the department since 2011, most recently serving as assistant chief. He takes over for former chief Jim Coyle, who resigned earlier this month in the wake of controversy. And Haltom City, Texas Police Chief Keith Lane had second thoughts about accepting the Presque Valley Police Chief position. He withdrew, stating he will be staying in Texas. However, the job was offered to Brian Gerald, who was the second top vote-getter. Gerald, who recently retired from the Milford, Michigan Police Department after almost 29 years, is scheduled to start November 25th. I'm Bill Monroe, and that's your KQNA News Week in Review.